CMC caught up with Steve Ford and the Flange on tour. So what's going on, Steve? Just uh, sound checking, man, Mill tour. It's um, it should be a cool gig. We uh, we haven't been down here before, so. Tomorrow is a fantastic day. You see Flange to the extreme. Does he do a good job? Yeah, he does do a good job. This is the the hardest working man in country music right here. He drives a bus, he doesn't sleep. He has all of our merchandise, does all of our loading, unloading. Left Sydney about midnight last night and drove right through and got into Mildura about, um, I don't know, one in the morning or something So it was a uh, big drive. A couple of us haven't, haven't sort of hit the sheets yet, but I'm sure we'll get a chance to some stage over the weekend anyway. <laughs> this is one band that travels in style. Meet the Flangemobile. This is where we live, man. This is. Um, DVD action, the PlayStation for the nerds in the band, and video DVD collection cannot be without that. This is the uh, shit fight we call home. Six bunks there for the boys, and that's my uh, den of sin back in there. We built it about, oh, I guess it's coming up two years ago now, maybe um, yeah, 20 odd months ago. My brother, uh, mother Brandon, a mate, uh, yeah, my brother Brandon, a mate, uh, did all the woodwork for me, and. Uh, yeah, me and my brother did like all the outskirts. It was a 58 seater school bus when we got it. And um, turned it into the flange mobile that we know today. So, what's it like being on the road with the flange? Oh, it's an experience, mate. I'll give you that. Yeah. Been drinking since 9 o'clock this morning. I've had the snacks and a quarter of a cent of cigarettes. Nothing like a road dog. So, you just did the sound check. What are you doing now? Uh, head back to the motel, uh, maybe get a quick shower, maybe a swim or something to cool down. It's uh, like middle of November, Mildura, plenty hot. The band started, I guess, two and a half years ago under a different uh, format. Mick and I have been together since the start, and Richie come in probably, what, 18 months ago, Richie? More. Nearly two years ago. Yeah, two years. Scotty come in a year ago, and um, Mal's sort of filling in for us, and... Um, Sort of stuff out. His, his main works with Carter and Carter these days. But he's, uh, <laughs> 15 minutes, everyone be in and out. If you have a shower, take a shower. I'm just going to jump in the pool and try my shorts on. Jump in the you pool. You can do product yourself to the max. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, man, it's all makeup time for yeah. you. We're going to <laughs> they follow us around for three months, just taking in the life of. Steve and the that, band, that, that and I mean, I don't know, I, I probably wouldn't like to watch it, but <laughs> as long as my mum doesn't see it, it'll be alright. So do you like touring? You gotta love touring. This band's always, always having fun, so. You know, always hanging out for the next weekend that we're going touring, so. Who knows what this weekend's gonna bring, eh? So it's gonna be a good show tonight? Yeah, I reckon, Neil. I reckon you won't be disappointed. We might be, but... <laughs> um, heading up to the gig, I gotta jump on the bus, yeah. get changed, and um, <coughs> we're gonna head up. Uh, I think it's like a. Get that <laughs> <laughs> I think it's like a 7:30 start or something. But you guys get nervous before you play? No, we just drink beer. <laughs> oh, I just writing out the revised set list, Neil. The first gig out on the uh, LK tour. Mr. Kernigan's uh, oh, been no, nice enough to let us come out and do a few shows. I think James Blundell's on the bill with us and uh, Tanya Kerr. Yeah. <laughs> hey, what's your most old school, his sweet sense of humor? You can really tell he left school like in the early 1990s. <laughs> so, what's it like being on the road? Good fun? It is, man. It's, it's great fun. What, what isn't there to like? You know, you're out traveling and seeing your homeland and getting paid to do it. You get to free beer at the same time. I can't think of anything better. Still, still work, fencing and farming, so, you know, I'm pretty sort of grand with the whole thing, but um, it's just fun. We have to finish on the dot of eight tonight. On the dot of eight, right? Who's got, who's got time? Uh, no, not me. I need to piss. I didn't get a chance. <laughs> <laughs>